Ladies and gentlemen, welcome in. This is the main event of the channel for the day. 1v1, Zik versus Tiger. Two of the absolute very best in the world going head to head in a best of nine competition. The races are ready. Let us jump right in. Curvy Canyon 2 is our first track. We're loading in now. Tiger's out to a quick start. Let's ride along for the first couple laps. Zix hanging right behind. Zix off to go through the tunnel. Let's see how they handle this section. Zix still right on the heels. Tiger's hitting all these pads. My goodness. The movement out of this character. A little too hot on the sides there, but... Uh, Zick is going to make up some ground. Let's ride along board. Now, if I remember correctly, I don't know if uh, I don't know if this is Zick's best map, but he's going to make something happen here on lap three if he wants uh, if he wants a chance. They're pretty close through this section. They are pretty close. Tiger is short a little bit on boost. What does Zick have for him on the first lap here? Close. They have a bit of a boost is similar, but Zick has a little bit of an advantage. I think he's going to build a little more here. But is he too far back to make the comeback? Is he going to come over the top? No, Tiger just clutches it up at the end with a 232 67 to a 23404. GG's, Tiger with the early series win, series lead, one game to none. Cliff Runner 2 is up next. That was an insane start to the competition. An easy world record coming out of Tiger. Woo! Let's jump on in. Cliff Runner 2, round two. Tiger up one game to none. Zick is out to the early lead. Right along board, Tiger. See what Tiger's got here. <laughs> Ooh. Let's take a little peek at uh, at Zix route. Nice and calm through there. Oh, stacking that very nicely. Tiger is in the picture. He's not out of it yet, even with hitting with hitting all those uh, hazards. Let's see if he's got anything for Zick on the final lap.
This may be closer than we first thought. Ooh, Tiger hit a hazard there. That might open the door for Zick. Zick has a lot of boost. Tiger's boost is a little bit a little bit down. It's a good thing he had that boost advantage, because he's gonna need it right there. Tiger, I think, is gonna be coming in hot. Tiger's down on boost too. I think Zick, as long as there's no mistakes made here, he will wrap this up. He will indeed. Zick evens the match. 1-1 with a 228.60 over Tiger. GG, gentlemen. We're all square after two. They do. They do need a better spectating system. But here we go. We're jumping on board. Outpost round three. Zick out to the early lead. Tiger not too far behind. Nice and clean through there from Zick. Well, he wanted to get rid of the boost, but he, he didn't. It stuck through there. Tiger flies on by. Is that gonna cost? Uh, is that gonna cost Zick? Cost Zick there the not releasing that boost. Tiger opted to not use any drift there, any turbo there. I think I heard Zick turbo through there. Zick hot on his heels now. He was able to release the drift that time. He did get the speed. He's opting to use his boost there. Zick opting to hold his boost. Zick's going to need to make something happen here on lap number three of round three. Tiger looks to be running this one pretty flawlessly. Let's check the boost usage. Tiger currently has a slight advantage in boost, but not by much. Well, that was clean through there by Zick. Zick is right on his heels now. I think they're both gonna have two boosts here when it's all said and done. I think Zick will end up getting his second boost. Is it gonna be enough? He's gonna need to get it right here. It looks like Tiger has eked this one out. Tiger takes round three with a 223.92 over Zick with a 225.09. I think that, uh, I think not getting that drift in there on, uh, on lap one from Zick was what really cost him. Here we go, round four. Tiger, two, Zick, one, windy way. We missed the whole lap. That's on me. Tiger is currently out front, and he hits the mag flip. Glad we got in for that mag flip. Wow. Zick must have had something treacherous happen to him. He's fallen quite a ways behind. He's right on board. Is he going to hit this again? Didn't quite hit it that time. Tiger is absolutely cooking right now. We did miss that. Though. 
Ah, he missed that as well. Dang. And he played it safe here. To secure the victory. Over Zick. With a 2 minute 85. Holy smokes. Putting in a cool 2 minutes. Wowzers. Tiger is absolutely cooking right now. Or, as some might say, Tiger is purring right now. Woo! Chat, if you're liking this, please, 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 please make sure to like the stream. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, man. Hit that subscribe button. If you really want to support, join on in. Join on in. Get to paddock seating right down here. Front row seat for the festivities. Woo! What a race that was. Zick is gonna need to make something happen here. Tiger Aura is currently up three to one in this best of nine. That does mean first to five. Gentlemans and ladies. Tigers up three, one. Round five, cut him for two. Zick out to the early lead. Tiger chasing. Oh no, Zick! That rock has the highest KD in all of rocket racing, and it claims Zick. He's in trouble. He's in trouble. He's gonna need a. Uh... Let's face it, he's going to need a miracle right now to uh, to come back against Tiger here. Tiger is not, he looks not too, too far back. We can't see him though. He went really clean, really safe through there. Again, safe. He knows that he has a large lead. He saw Zick die on that rock. Look back and not see a Zick in his rear view mirror. Tiger's probably just gonna lock this down here, play it safe. He has just done that. They both went for it on lap one. It cost Zick dearly. Tiger's gonna cross the line with a safe time. Zick, the pressure is now on. Tiger with a 150.44. That rock strikes again. Tiger now has a commanding lead. Some would say the jaws are closing in on Zick's neck. Tiger is currently up four to one in a best of nine. The first person to reach five wins will win the series. Festive Falls is our round six map. This is not Zick's best map, but maybe he's putting some work on it in the past week. Maybe he's putting some work. He needs to pull something out here in order to survive in this competition. It's the whole lap. But Tiger is just out ahead. Zick is hanging onto the back. He's gonna need to pull something out here. Ooh, that was very clean from Zick. Is he going to hit that pad? He is going to hit the pad. These guys are neck and neck now. Ooh, Zick has opted to go on top. I don't mind this. Is Zick going to have a little extra boost through here? This is going to be extremely close. If he hits this perfect, I think he could have it. And he's gonna have another boost. This is a whole new strat from Zick on Festive Falls. Is this gonna be enough to pull it out? Is it gonna be enough? It's gonna come down to the wire. Zick pulls it out with a 127.94.
pulls it out and stays alive. Wow, 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 wow. Zick with the comeback. My heart was pumping a little bit there. Wow. Here we go. Round seven. Anarchy Arches. Tiger four. Zick two. Let's ride on board. Zick out with an early lead. We'll ride along board the chase car here. Now, Tiger didn't have much success with the fires of Cliff Runner 2. Let's see if his fortunes can change here on Anarchy Arches. We all know Zick's extremely consistent. And if he does get a lead, it's very, very hard to get a lead off him. He has world record pace in almost every track he plays. And he needs to prove it. Here and then again on the next track in order to push an incredible game nine. Ooh, Tigers missed that pad. He doesn't have much pace right here. So he's gonna wait to use it on this pad. He's gonna save his boost. Let's go right on board Zick. Ooh, so a short little drift there. I like that. He goes wide to get a lot of drift. This is the optimal route. Make sure you don't slip onto that cliff side. You can see Tiger just peeking out the back. Tiger made huge gains through that section. He must have boosted. Zick, wise, holding his boost when he needs to use it. He will use one here. He doesn't want to store it up for too long. It's a great section through there. Tiger lagging a little bit behind. But again, these two are so evenly matched. Oh, this is a huge play from Zick. Using on that pad, holding his boost, holding his drift, using on that pad. Let's see if Tiger has anything left in the tank on lap three of Anarchy Arches 2 in this game seven. Best of nine match. Tiger, I think he's gonna get the three boosts. Zick is holding on to his boost as well. I don't know if Tiger meant to do that or not, but he's done it. Tiger is not quite able to cross the line in front of Zick. So Zick forces a game eight with a 246-77. Wow. The competition is really ramping up. Tiger four, Zick three. We're going to Sidewinder, but Zick was the first one to get a sub three minute. He does have a 258.7, and he's gonna need it right now. He's gonna need it right now. Tiger currently up four games to three. Tiger wins, competition's over. Zick wins, he forces a game nine. The decisive game nine at Anaconda. Let's jump right into the action. Tiger up to the early lead. Zick hot on his heels though. Let's ride along Zick. He's gonna need to put in his best work here. Tiger does look to be purring along though. Zick is still hot on his heels. Let's ride along Tiger for this lap. Let's take a lap with Tiger. Zick is still close behind. Tiger just needs to compose himself here if he wants to pull this one out. Where Tiger, I think, excels above everybody else is keeping 
the drift. He's always holding drift whenever he jumps. He uses that slingshot. Zick is still right behind. See, like, here he's going to drift, and he's going to hold it. But now when he lands, he's going to get that drift a little bit sooner than everybody else. But Tiger can see Zick in the bottom of his screen. That's right on board Zick for this last lap. He needs to make something happen here. If he wants to have a chance. Both of these racers extremely consistent. Zick is definitely the model of consistency. Tiger's game is a little more flashy. For me, it's just that black and orange car. I don't know. This is going to come right down to the wire. Zick needs to pull something out here. It's going to be tough, though. He needs to hit a banner. Oh, my goodness. He almost did. Tiger with a 257.93 to a 258.29. Ladies and gentlemen, Tiger is your 1v1 match winner. 5 to 3 over Zick. Let's get some absolute hype in the chat for both these wonderful racers. They put on quite a show for us.